Hey everybody, Andrew here from Tip B, and in this video we're going to show you a new jailbreak modification in Cydia called Mail More Photos. Um, it does exactly what the name implies. It allows you to mail more photos uh, from the Photos uh, app picker, um, or your Photos albums, or whatever album you have set up in your in your Photos app. Um, so to get started, you're going to want to jump into Cydia. <clears throat> the app does cost a dollar which in my opinion is well worth it um, so go to the search tab and search for mail more should automatically find it there mail more photos again it does cost 99 cents um, you can pay through PayPal by connecting via Facebook or Google um, and there's a couple of other payment options but uh, I usually go with PayPal you'd usually hit install there after you've paid and it would go through the installation process. It does require a quick respring in order to see the effects. Um, once you're done, you just jump into the Photos app, and I'll give you a little demonstration. Usually the max number of photos that you can email from within the Photos app is five photos at a time. So here, I'll just select as many photos as I can. Obviously that's more than five. And tap the Share button, and you can email all of the photos that are selected. Now the great thing about this as well, uh, it, you'll see that the photos are added right into the mail message itself. And the cool thing about this is when you do select the photos, it'll give you the actual size of the email itself. Um, so I'm going to be selecting, sending 15, 16 photos here and it's going to be almost 13 megabytes worth of photos. Um, again. Uh, iOS 5, I think back to iOS 4, it could be even earlier than that. Um, Apple only allows you to send five at a time. Uh, with this modification, you'll be able to send an unlimited amount of photos. Um, no limit whatsoever. I think there may be a limit on the mail server. Uh, things like Gmail, they do have a limit on the amount of files that you can send in one message. Um, but this takes care of the limitation, at least in iOS. So that's how it works. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments, and thanks for watching.